these slave owner oligarchs that are breaking laws left and right. We need to call this out in detail, in accountability detail, but we need to unite the clans. When we're talking about different issues, whether they be Bradley Manning in a jail cell for simply being a journalist is our fourth branch of government, the media. They are the ones who have failed us. They are the ones who have failed us. We have always relied on that fourth pillar. Without that fourth pillar, we are nothing. So they not only do not report the truth, they are a weapon now. They use it as a weapon against us. So fuck them. We are the media now. We are the media. We don't need them. They cannot, when they come to me, they, I've turned down over 100 interviews. As I ran and raved about Fukushima is going to give you cancer the day it happened. I'm a socioeconomist. Seven months later, I got a stomach ache, thought I had food poisoning. Went from 170 pounds to 130 pounds in three weeks. In a bone marrow transplant center for 269 days in critical condition. Kept my activism going with my central line hanging out of my chest. People have followed my path along as even as I've been deathly ill, given two months to live, two years later I'm standing, because I fight the good fight. I don't do it for money. I don't play those black and yellow journalistic whores game. They come to me, CNN, Fox, CBS, all of them. I am the alternative to the alternative. We are the alternative to the alternative because we simply want the truth. So who needs them? Not us. We are the media. We are the truth tellers. We are the fighters. They could go along with their Uncle Tom ways because they've gone too far now. They've gone too far. They began to eat their own. They thrashed our dollar. Our dollar went from 80 cents to a buck six. It's gone. Our wealth's gone. Everybody says, oh, the market's going to collapse. The economy's going to... It already collapsed. This is the... This is feudalism. This is the return of King George 1774. We've wiped out everything we fought for, but the crowning jewel, they could take our jobs. They could take all our money. They've stripped our dignity. They stripped it, but now they took the very essence of life. They're taking our air that we breathe. Fukushima, born in the Pacific for 970 days. Can you have the biggest cover up, Plume Gate. I call it the Pacific Genocide. These things all fold together, all fold together. And Anonymous is our last line of defense. They are our last line of defense. Without Anonymous, we have nothing. We have nothing. They are the heroes of our time. They are the Sam Adams of our time. They are the true patriots. As they want to try to lock us up for simply telling the truth, did any of you ever think it would be so difficult in your lifetime to simply tell the truth. Tell to tell the truth is to go to prison. To steal billions of dollars is to be an oligarch god. And the sheep will go along. We are not sheeple. And then we are not. I was asked in an interview, and he says, well, Occupy had millions of people. And I says, 